Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing another Sephora haul. I know, it's pretty bad, but when you work at Sephora and you see all the new products coming in, you just want to buy everything. So I did a little more shopping. This is going to be kind of like a first impression as well as a haul. So yeah, jumping right into it. The first thing I got is the Too Faced Semi-Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette. Who hasn't bought this? I never had the first one, but when the second one came out, I really wanted to try it. This is what the packaging looks like if you haven't seen it. It's a, like a milk chocolate packaging. And then on the inside it has all of these colors. Now I am wearing this on my lids today. And my first impression of it is I really, really like it. I've heard mixed reviews. Some people don't like it. Some people think it's not too pigmented. I think it's really pigmented. I think there are some shadows that could be more pigmented. But the ones that I really gravitate towards are the pigmented ones. And I really like that. So I'm wearing peanut butter in my crease, caramel and bonbon on my lid, and truffled in my outer half. And also I highlighted with butter pecan. So I'm using this today for the first time and yeah, I really like it. I don't think I'll be returning it because I think the colors are pretty pigmented. I love the way it smells and I'm impressed with it. I never had the first one so I don't have anything to really compare it to, but I really like this one. So. This is the semi-sweet chocolate bar. And let me know if you want to see a review or anything on this or a tutorial, and I will definitely do that, but I'm pretty sure there's a lot out there already. Next thing I got is from Soap and Glory. This is a new skincare product. This is called Peaches and Clean 4-in-1 Wash Off Deep Cleansing Milk. This is supposed to melt away your makeup, and I specifically bought this because it smelled so good. I always smelled it in the store. It smells like peaches and kind of like mintiness at the same time. Which is kind of a weird combination if you think about it. But I really like the scent. So I used it last night for the first time. And I used a makeup wipe first and then I used this. And it took off all the excess makeup that I had on my face. And also it was very creamy. It left my skin smelling really, really delicious. The only thing I would say is you definitely want to put a moisturizer on after you use this. My skin did feel a little bit dry, so which is odd because it's a cleansing milk. But yeah, I would just recommend putting a moisturizer on after you use this, which you should do anyway. So I got this. This was $28, but so far I do really like it. I love the way it smells. You guys should definitely go into Sephora and smell it. This is actually limited edition, so get your hands on this. Next thing is another new product. This is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. Now, we have a tester of this in my store, and I always spray my face with this because it's so refreshing. So this is what it looks like, and basically, let's see what it says. It's infused with electrolytes to prime your face, hydrate skin for hours, and revitalize complexion to boost radiance. So I've only put this on over my makeup. It makes my skin feel very hydrated and refreshed, which I really like. I haven't tried it underneath my makeup yet, but I will let you guys know how it works for makeup power lasting long wear. Does that make sense? Probably not. But it is so refreshing and it smells like Sprite and I really, really enjoy this as just like a misting, hydrating, finishing primer water. But this was a little expensive. It was $32. Next thing I have is the Sephora Express Cleansing Wipes. This comes with 25 makeup wipes. It's just the Sephora brand. And they smell very refreshing. They kind of smell... They kind of just smell clean, kind of like soap. And I used this last night. And it took off all my makeup in like one swipe, which was really nice. Usually I have to kind of like rub my eyes, which you shouldn't do, but I do it. But I really, really like this for taking off my makeup. I think it worked really, really well. Um, this is $9, which is kind of expensive for makeup wipes, but I got them and I like them. So the last thing I got is the Hoola Bronzer by Benefit. And I've only had the little sample size of this, which it lasted me a really long time, probably around like six months. But I finished it, so I decided to get a full size. And I really like this bronzer because it has no orange tones. It's more like on the ashy side. This is perfect for contouring your cheekbones. So I got this. A lot of people think it's a cream, but it is a powder. And I think this looks good on everyone's skin tone. So I highly recommend the Hoola bronzer. Um, and it will last you a really long time. So I finally decided to pick up one of these full size. This is $28. 
And that was everything I got at my Sephora trip. I hope you guys enjoy these little hauls that I keep doing. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.